Hello my dear babies. Welcome to Kid Short Stories. I'm really sorry for a long gap. Okay, come let's go inside a story now. Before going in, please subscribe to the channel whoever had not subscribed and click on a notification bell. There's a bell button, click on it. Only then you'll get notified whenever a new video is uploaded. Let's go and set a story now. And today's story is a long story. We are going to see it in parts. Okay. A bit, bit. A, a little bit today, a little bit tomorrow. So we are going to see a bit of bit. Because it's a big story. Okay, fine. What is the story is all about? Everyone know about a poo. Who's poo? Winnie the poo. You know, right? It's a favorite Cartoon character for everyone, Winnie the Pooh. So let's see what is going to do with the Winnie the Pooh. Okay, the story name is Good as Gold. Winnie's story is all about Good as Gold. What is the gold here? Is it a real gold? Let's go inside the story and check. Okay, one drizzly day, Winnie the Pooh decided to stay inside and count his honey pots. Every day the Pooh is to go out and play with his friends, enjoy his day. But today he decided to stay inside his house and count his honey pots. You know right, Pooh likes honey. He likes honey so much. So he'll have actually in his counter, he'll have so many honey pots. Today he decided to count how many honey pots he have. I know I had three pots of honey yesterday, he said to himself. So I should have three pots of honey today. When he saw yesterday, no, there was three pots in a shelf. So he told to himself, I saw yesterday there was three pots. So I'll be having three pots for today. Who opened this cupboard and counted slowly? One, two, he said out loud, Two? Who repeated, scratching his head, Oh, bother! I seem to be missing number three. I wonder where it could be. Who opened the cupboard and started to count the spots? He said, One, two, after two, there's no three. The th third pot is missing. Who was very scared. Oh my God. Where does my third pot gone? Who had taken it? He started to search here and there. It's bothering him so much. So what will he do? Just then, Ro hoped through the door. Come and see the rainbow poo. The little kangara called hoping up and down. When he was thinking about the missing third pot, Ro came inside. Who is Ro? A little kangaroo. He just came in and said, Come and see the rainbow poo. It's so beautiful. Come and see. The kan little kangaroo was jumping, hopping up and down and he was calling Pooh to come outside and see the beautiful rainbow. Pooh forgot all about his missing honey pot and followed his friend outside. There he found owl and tiger gazing up at the sky. So when the kangaroo, little kangaroo came in, Pooh forgot about his missing pot. He came outside with his friend Ro. And when he came out, he saw there was an owl and tiger gazing up on the sky. What they were seeing at the sky? Owl said, Did I ever tell you what my uncle made us said about rainbows? He said, the support of gold at the end of everyone. Howell said, my uncle was telling there's something in rainbow. Did I ever share it to you? He asked. Then he started continuing to tell, there will be a pot of gold at the end of every rainbow. That's what my uncle said. So I will explain to his friends. What's gold? Ro asked. The little kangar did not understand what is gold. He is asking to the owl, what is gold? Gold is something valuable, Ro. Owl explained. 
Owl started to explain to the little kangaroo, gold is something valuable. You all know, right? What is gold? So, but this little kangaroo was not knowing what is gold. He started to explain, gold is something valuable. Something anyone would like to have a lot. What is that? It's something everyone wants to have a lot. Gold is very costly, very valuable thing. So, we all want gold, right? That's what Howl is explaining. As Pooh wants to have more honey, the same way we all wants to have more gold. Pooh said, hopefully, as I want to have a lot of honey, gold is also something which everyone wants to have a lot with them. Not exactly, Howl replied, puffing out his chest. Gold is a shiny, yellowish kind of thing. Howl is... Oh, coming out still. Not exactly like you, Paul. Who want to have a lot of honey? But gold, we all want. But Owl is telling, no, not like you. Gold is something shiny and yellowish color. That sounds like honey, Who interrupted. When the Owl said it is gold in color, gold is in shiny, yellowish color, Who said, Ah, I think it's something like honey. Well, it's not, said Howl, becoming annoyed. Owl is getting angry because Pooh is always talking about honey, right? So Owl said, no, it's not. It's not like honey. I'm sorry, Pooh, said Howl. For he remembered that Pooh being a bear of very little brain sometimes needed extra help understanding things. Let me explain it this way, he said. Uh, Owl got angry and said in a rude way, it's not like a honey. But he felt sorry for that and said, sorry Pooh. He is a small guy, right? Pooh is a very small animal. He is having a, a small, very little brain. It's a very cool, small bear. So he needs some extra help in understanding some something like gold and other things. So... Owl decided, let me explain in a different way so that you can understand what is gold. Gold is a precious metal. It's so precious that you can trade it for things you want. Owl said, gold is something very precious, very costly metal. With this, you can trade something. You can give the gold for something you want to buy. It's something very precious. Like honey? Who could not help say? Who again interrupted the owl? Like honey, is it? Owl said, I suppose, trying to be patient. Owl is getting angry, but it's trying to keep patient, telling, I suppose. So the poo was wondering, oh my god. And so it was that Owl, Pooh, Tiger and Ro went in search of the pot at the end of the rainbow. So when the Owl explained what is gold, all the friends. Who are the friends? Owl, Pooh, Tiger and Ro. All they went in search of a pot of gold which will be available at the end of the rainbow. As the friends hurried through the forest, hoping that the rainbow wouldn't disappear before they found the gold, they ran into Piglet. What happened? All friends were like very in hurry. They in a hurry hurry to the forest so that the rainbow will not disappear from the sky before finding the pot of gold. When they are in that hurry, they met one more friend, Piglet. Who is that piglet? We'll see tomorrow. Okay? So for today, that's it. We'll continue the story by tomorrow. Okay, goodies? Subscribe to the channel. If you like the video, click on like button. Share with your friends and family. And enjoy it. Take care. Have a good day. Bye.